I found you, I'm starting to think that love is true. Take it back to 2014, it was the best days. We was doing us with money in the worst way. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Jamia. It's your boy, Keith, man. And y'all, we had a, um, I had to get emergency surgery. Was it yesterday? It was yesterday. Yes, yesterday. Friday, yesterday. Friday morning. So yeah, as you guys. Oh yeah, because I don't know when y'all gonna get this video. Yeah, as you guys can see by the title, man, uh, we had to do an emergency surgery. So maybe he had to plan some things out. I had to rush her to the to the doctor Friday morning. What at what time? Five. At five o'clock. Surgery started at seven. And uh, I'm gonna let baby tell you all a little bit about it, and then I'm gonna get into details of what I know, and you know what I'm saying what's going on. So. All right, so, all right, y'all. First, I got the doctor. And, uh, and it's only if y'all watched our the video before this. Yeah, the video before this, and we let y'all know that the baby may be coming early, so we had to take a few precautious steps. Okay, okay so I got to the doctor. I got to the hospital. They um, changed my told me to change my clothes. Yeah. Um, what they do? Oh. We got to first. We got to do a corona test. Yeah, I she, had to, she had to take a corona test just to get surgery, so it's that it's that serious now. I know y'all know all about the COVID nineteen, the corona, but I hate that test. Yeah, so she told me she had to do that first. And then, they check my blood pressure. They asked me a bunch of questions about my history. It was so annoying. Yeah, I know how they do all that. Type. What you're allergic to? Have yeah. you been outside the country in the last thirty days? Yes. All oh, this crazy. Y'all know how they do it. Drink. Yeah. Like maybe, but not right now. You eat pork. No. no. <laughs> so then they uh was looking for a vein, y'all. Took four times to find. Well, not to find the vein, but to poke me. And they four finally times. got one in for my IV. They took me back to the surgery room. I met the surgery team. And then. Was um, they pretty cool? Did you like the surgery team? It was cool. It was super nice. And you said the doctor was cool? Because she, yeah, she, the lady was like, Are you shaking because you cold? Right? I was like, Yeah. So she was going to give me some warm blanket. And then she came back and she said, are you shaking because you're nervous now? I said, she said, you was probably nervous the first time. I said, yeah. Yeah, you probably rather be in a sweat. I don't think I'll take a heart attack. Like anxiety attack. Oh my God. Oh my God. So, I mean, this is a scary moment. You know what I'm saying? We had our first son at 30 weeks. We got a scare at 23 and a half weeks, almost 24. And if y'all get this video, when y'all get this video, the next few days, we'll be at 24 weeks. So, uh, it was definitely something to be nervous about, man. We had a, uh... It was so scary. Yeah, it was definitely something to be nervous about. So, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let baby keep going on with the story for just a second. Okay, so the, this guy had came in. He was like, he told me his name and everything. He was like, you're about to get an epidural. Mm -hmm. I'm about to use some anesthesia through it. I'm about to dump your whole bottom side of your body. Okay, now I forgot about that, y'all. I forgot that she told me because, mind me, y'all, I can't be in a surgery room and they don't let... A lot of people in the room right now, like I'm here now, but I can't bring the baby or nothing with me. But I forgot for the women that had kids before, you know, uh, when you do a vaginal, you got to get the epidural. So my baby had to get the epidural just for the surgery. Oh my God. So, so he had gave me a shot to numb my back and he had put some stuff on it, on my back. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it looked like because I couldn't see. And then uh, the lady was talking to me. She was just like, so. Hold your son. I bet he's real cute. You're pretty to that. And then she was like, you alright? And I was like, yeah, I'm alright. I was like, I'm just waiting for him to do his epidural because that's a hurt. She's yeah. like, no, you're done. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, she was like, uh, I, I distracted you enough. And I was like, how's we done? I said, because with baby Keith, y'all. Yeah, it's no, the baby. second time. And I seen it with yes. baby Keith. Like, I seen them put the little dots behind her back to Ooh. see where they going to do the little at. And I you know what I'm saying, I baby, can't move it. Yeah, it's like, so if you tell me that she just did it like, I mean, they did it like that. Yeah. You didn't even feel it. And then he was like, you about to feel the medicine, y'all. When I tell y'all about the cold rush, everything went numb instantly. Like, it didn't take, you know how, like, the Ever didn't work for baby keys? Like, I, it, it worked when I was done at him. I was like, yeah. I can't feel my leg. Yeah. But instantly, she was like, I want to lay you down. You're not going to be able to feel anything. She said, I'm poking you. Can you feel it? I was like, I don't feel anything. So instantly, you had the spaghetti legs. <laughs> it was kind of weird because it was a room full of people, so I'm like, oh my and I ain't got no clothes on, so oh, I'm like, person in here, half body. Yes. Oh and then it was just like, I don't know if he was white or like Asian or something. He was cool. He was real cool. Yeah. But like, what he was going to search the anesthesia dude. Oh, the other anesthesia. Like, nah, he's not the one that yeah. did it. He kept saying, good? I don't know. Am I like, I can't see down there. Right. So I'm like, I don't know. But he just kept going, you need anything? Some food? No yeah. laundry. 
But, uh, some snacks. So y'all. Uh, so how long? How long did it? Uh, so you were awake the whole time during the surgery. The whole time. You just couldn't feel back. your bottom. You couldn't feel your bottom half. You couldn't see your bottom half. No, and I had oxygen in my nose, and I had on a face mask. Okay. Uh, so how long did it seem like? How long did it seem like it took for the surgery to go? Like, I'll say forty-five minutes, fifty 40, minutes, forty-five, fifty minutes. Like almost out. And they working down there because you're getting uh, how do you say it? I got a surplot. A surplot. So I'm sure ladies might know what that is. I know men. You guys not, might be. You could put the um, description in yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, guys, you might be lost as me, but <laughs> she got a surplot stitch. So I'm gonna put that right here. Put the description of it. You know what I'm saying? So you can get a brief uh, description on what kind of surgery she had to get. And uh, so actually, you know, you know, it turned out. So y'all, he told me he was like, um. He told me before it started, he said, I don't know how much you dial it, I don't know none of that. Once. So I might have to come back, like, come around and talk to you and let you know, you know. So I was like, okay. So he came around and he was like, um, so I'm going to let you know I'll see the baby. See said, your butt. He said, he, the doctor said he seen the baby. Girl. He was like, and I see the water, I see the bag. He seen her butt. The baby. <laughs> oh my God, she is already showing her ass, y'all. I mean, come on, she is stepping on the haters and breaking yeah, necks. Yeah, she was stepping on the haters, so. You could hear the whole surgery I'm like, oh my god, is that her? I'm like, oh my god. I'm thinking like, am I having her? Like, oh, I started getting my heart. I was having a heart attack and I know that it's like a heart attack. Oh my god. So then he was like, uh, I would have to push her in a little bit, push the bag in. Mm -hmm. it, the bag could rupture and you could have her. He was like, but do you want me to do it? And I was like, yeah, of course. Like, you know, yeah, I, I, I want to be thinking. pregnant for right, that. Right. So he did it. I couldn't feel it, but I could hear him. My legs, I felt some pressure down there. Mm -hmm. And then, um, I can hear certain people are happy and laugh, and I'm like, oh, he had to do it because y'all gonna be on there laughing and happy if my water got broken. Hey, real shit. Yeah, no, this ain't no, this ain't no game. Yes, yeah, so he came up to me, y'all. He was like, uh, we're done. I did it. It's tight. He was like, you got like 10 weeks. You can keep her in there for 10 weeks. He was like, bed rest. But I'm gonna meet you to the hospital because I didn't know that you was gonna be dilated. You know, yeah. I didn't know that I was gonna be able to see your baby. He was like, so we wanna watch over you for a couple of days. He was like, I'm gonna call your husband in the car and stuff like that. Damn. So yeah, he yeah, had uh, he had called me. He told me everything. He told me that the surgery was successful. Then he told me that they were gonna have to admit my baby into the hospital. So she been here for uh, about like a day and a half, and she get to leave tomorrow morning. So I'm just up here like I am now. I have breakfast. He brought me some pizza. So because uh, I brought her some pizza today, Subway so, well, yesterday, just because you know it's better than. I'm gonna show you all a little bit of this. This food they want you chowing on it here. <laughs> but uh yeah they doing visitations real slow so i just wanted to come see my baby i wanted to let y'all know give y'all a little rundown uh the doctor said how many weeks he said he'd give it we get about about 10 more weeks about 10. so man he the doctor saying that well, he think give about us it, 10 since months. i'm already 20 he, he considered me 23. Like, yeah you know? that's what i was thinking he so, rounded up. Yep. Yeah, so I think he's considered thirty four weeks. Okay. Yeah. So That's the a long doctors time. the doctor's uh prediction is he's thinking that we will be around thirty four weeks is when he thinks we'll be delivering. So uh that's better than our first time. Well that's better than what this time was gonna be. I was about to yeah, be delivering her four days. It's better than what we were almost into, just what you know what I'm saying, high risk and not knowing what's going on. So uh four more weeks more than our son, I feel like that's an, that's that's good. So, uh, because my mom excited. had my sister at 32 weeks, yes, and she was four pounds, seven ounces, and yes, she went home in like a week. So, so yeah, we just uh, we super excited, guys. I know I'm super excited. I want to meet my daughter, I want to, you know, I want to bring her into this world healthy. I don't want her to, Did you, you know, whoop her for showing her butt. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to tell her, like, hey, baby, you was <laughs> showing your ass at a young age now, you know what I'm saying? But I know we both just, we both just excited. We both want her here. We both want her healthy. That's what matters first. Uh, that's just, you know what I'm saying? That's what's going to come first. Anything else will come, you know what I'm saying, after that. But I'm super excited, man. If y'all don't know, if y'all can't see y'all, it's going to have a little girl, her face, my face, and a uh, little baby. So, uh... And y'all... What's funny is I called him this morning to see Baby Keith, and um, Baby Keith was in there trying on his school clothes. Yeah, <laughs> I was. I woke up, man. This dude got shirt on, shorts on backwards, mismatched socks. He probably put on all some all shoes. If you had them down, oh my god, he were trying his new shoes. Oh my god, but I think he's showing his butt too because yeah. he, he just you know you know he's about to be I think a big he brother. Me. Yeah. yeah, I think he misses mom too. So hey, y'all. 
So we just want to give y'all a little rundown. We expecting at 34 weeks. Now this, this is what I got to tell y'all. If y'all want to see the baby, when the baby is due, y'all got to get both of our Instagram accounts to 6K followers. So if y'all want to see the baby, y'all got 10 weeks. I'm not posting baby on Facebook. Y'all need to get our Instagrams to 6,000 followers each. Now, uh, our, you know, it's going to be in the description. It's going to be at the bottom of the video. So, man, just make sure y'all get our, if y'all want to, because if by the time we do, we neither one of us got 6K followers each on Instagram, we're not showing y'all the baby. So, and if y'all get this far in the video, comment on there and say, uh, Team Mia and Keith. Yeah. And if y'all do that, I'll make him um, film my whole delivery. Yeah, so if y'all uh, if y'all made this far in the video, comment team me, comment team Keys, and if uh, we get a few of those comments, because it means you guys are watching the full videos, I will tape the labor and delivery. We'll let y'all see everything, at least as much as we out. can. They'll see me cut you out. Y'all gonna see her cussing me out. Y'all gonna see her probably have me in the headlock. Whatever I can show, I'm gonna show. So just make sure y'all comment down there if y'all want to see that, because uh, we will love to show y'all, for sure. So how are we coming, baby? You feeling better? Because you here. My baby said she feeling better. Oh my god, so you know I look, look like a fat hog. Man, she is not fat, y'all. Y'all tell him I look like a fat hog. Cause um, he keeps saying I don't look pregnant. I look pregnant. Look at my face, my nose. I don't see it. You look cute, you look sexy. That's my baby. I'm ready to bring my baby home so we can go chill, eat some good food. Y'all gotta be on bed rest, so I'm about to go lay my booty down. We gotta chase after this little bad little boy. You man. gotta chase after him. Oh my god, but he gonna just be running. This me. next ten weeks is gonna go fast, y'all. So that's why I'm not even really like worried about nothing. Cause when we first found out, she was like three or four weeks. Now we are oh. twenty weeks later, and that seemed like oh it was god. just yesterday. So I know the next ten weeks is gonna fly. If our Instagram accounts on got six k followers, <laughs> uh, you guys are not seeing the baby, so <laughs> it's gonna be all Ross up Taylor. to y'all. You're not gonna see it on Facebook, Snap, none of that. So I'm not posting her. So yeah, it's up to y'all, man. If y'all really, if y'all really rocking with, us, like y'all say, I rocking with it. Drop team me and drop team keys. Go hit the. Uh, the like, comment, and subscribe button, please. Turn the notification bell on. Get them followers up on Instagram, y'all. And hey, we're going to keep turning up. Because after the baby, I already got pranks lined up, y'all. I'm about to have her running out the house, man. It's going to get lit. I ain't going to talk about it. Just know we took a quick detour. We'll get cussed out. But we time. back, y'all. We back. Say something to the Karen, baby, because I'm, I'm I love y'all, and I'm happy I did this. I'm happy that I get to keep her in for longer. Yes, I'm happy, too. Hmm. Well, so make sure y'all stay tuned to us and make sure y'all follow our social media accounts. Yes. And we'll be back. Hey, Team Keys, Team Me, the Collins Gang. We are the Collins mission. Before we die, we gotta get paid. Whole time, I'm thinking she ain't gonna be disgraced. Fast forward, we had a son who can't be paid.